Oh man. Oh man, what am I playing today? What am I playing today? It's black screen. This is the best game ever, black screen. Black screen's my favorite game. Oh wait, what's this? Bethesda. I think they made that uh FPS game. I don't I don't remember what they <gasps> Oh my god! Guys! Today I'm playing Scarum! This is probably the best game since Ocarina of Time. So what is up, everybody? This is Alex, oh. Alex. Alexo. And today I'm playing Skyrim. That is right. Fucking Skyrim. And we're just gonna load up this random ass profile because uh, I'm just playing. And I haven't actually played any of the DLC for the game, which people were like, what the fuck, man? You can't even ride on dragons. You never rode on dragons. It's like, dude, there's way too much shit in this game to even fucking get started on completing all the shit I got already. Oh, what's going on here? Okay, I, I can't... I don't understand. Oh, jeez. Oh, my gosh. Holy shit. As you guys can see, I am really fucking overweighted right now. So I think I was just building up, like, a bunch of fucking armors and shit. Because uh, I like to do that. <clears throat> and as you can see, my dragon... My dragon powers that freeze right now. And my character is actually like a thief class sort of deal. I, I enjoy uh, just being an asshole in Skyrim. Because who the fuck doesn't want to be an asshole in Skyrim? It's like, if you can't be an asshole in real life, at least you can be an asshole in Skyrim. So, Oh, and the load times in this game. I tell you what, the load times in this game, it's like, yeah. If you want to have any connection with the outside world, that's what it the load screens so were invented for. Yeah, I married this chick. Um, I just did it for the achievement. Yeah, that's right. I married you for the achievement. I married you for the achievement. Nothing else. And I got some, uh, cool... Well, I mean, this one's that one from that quest. And I was like, fuck, yeah, I'm keeping that. And so, uh, this right here is actually where I keep most of my shit. Because it's like, fuck it. Like, why would I walk through the whole damn house just to store a bunch of shit? Can't store that. Yeah, this I've had this since, like, the beginning of the game. I don't know where the fuck I'm supposed to take this. I've just had it, and every time I look at it, I'm like, oh, I'm going to store it. Nope. Nope. You're not storing that shit. Like, I'm not going to lie. There's only, like, one problem with Skyrim, and that's trying to figure out where some of this shit goes. I mean, I do know that there's, like, a thing to look for, like, your fucking quests or whatever, but, I mean, even trying to find it all on that fucking list, which I'm trying to pull up, but I can't remember. Is it, yeah, it's start. Hmm. Yeah, because look at all these malicious quests I got open here. Mis miscellaneous. Miscellaneous quest. Malicious. Miscellaneous. Two separate words. Why am I reading... Malicious for miscellaneous. Me mesel miscellaneous. Sounds like some stupid ass Harry Potter spell. Miscellaneous! And that's the spell that you scream at dragons to get them to sleep with you. I mean, come on. I, I, I know people that have slept with uh, Charizards and never gone back. That's how you get a shiny Pokemon. <clears throat> the fuck am I talking about? I, I don't even know. Now, as you notice... Yes, I did do that glitch to wear more than one piece of armor. I don't care. If, if, it, if it was an online game, I would not do something like that, because that's real low. Like, I, I feel it's a single-player game. It's by myself, so I, I'm really not really affecting anybody else by doing something like that. It just makes the game a little bit different in some aspects to where I'm not dying every five minutes because I decide to travel somewhere that I would regularly get fucked up at, so. And that's okay. Because, um, I know a lot of people that do worse than what I've done on here, so. I mean, I don't even do the thing for, like, the weapons for, you know, upgrading them to where you can have, like, indestructible powers. It's like, no, man, I, I want to play, but I don't want to be a god in terms of, like, guys are easier to take down. I just want to chill. Yeah, guys? You guys want to chill? Yeah, we're going to chill, guys. We're going to play Skyrim. It's cool. Got to get the notched pickaxe. Dear Lord, it's already been fucking eight minutes. Eight minutes and I sat in the fucking house. 
best playthrough ever. Yeah, this is the thing about Skyrim. Look at this. Look at this map. That is friggin' insane! How the fuck- like, I can't- I've never- I can't even comprehend somebody completing all of the fucking quests in this game. And if there's somebody out there that's done it, what the hell, man? Go outside! Hey. Yeah, let's go there. That looks cool. Oh, and here's my Thieves Guild, which I am also the leader of. I haven't exactly done the uh, Wolf or the, uh, you know, like the, the Heroes Guild or whatever the fuck. I haven't done that on this account because uh, this is my thief. This is my guy that does thievery. And so, yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna have a thievery on this account. And it's gonna be fun. Okay? Yeah, I tell you, I just kind of want to chill. And I just want to play some Skyrim. Had a pretty fucking crazy morning getting up. And, you know, like, there's a lot of people that need their coffee in the morning. And if you guys have been watching me for a long time, you know that I need my caffeine right when I get up. <laughs> because, uh, man. Just, like, you know, I got up and there's no, uh, like, 12 packs or anything in the house anymore. So I was like, oh, no. Oh, no. I was like this guy right here. I was like in the back. I was on fire and it was bad. The fuck? Oh shit! Oh Charizard! Alright, come on fucker. Oh, it's a frost dragon. Oh shit. Hold on a second. I got my uh... Yeah, dragon wrench. Go! Go, 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 Oh, and then I put the swords away. What is my problem? Come on. Come on. Yeah. Fuck. Fuck you. Go! So I guess he's not Charizard. He's, he's an ice dragon, like Frost. So I guess he's like Articuno. Yeah, if anybody's wondering, Articuno is my favorite Pokemon ever. And that's it. I order the yacht. Stop what right the fuck? <laughs> Dude, like, I just killed a dragon, and you're like, Hey, thanks for saving us, but, uh, you're under arrest. Like, what the fuck? I feel like the Ghostbusters, man. Like, yeah. Yeah, thanks for just saving us from the ghosts, but, uh, you're frauds. So, uh, fuck you. I submit. Take me to jail. No. I'd rather die than go to prison, and then you run. Fucking, uh, okay. Fuck you. I should have stolen a horse. But my guy... My guy's pretty cool. He can run for a long time. I am actually a, uh... The lizard. Oh, man. Why can't I remember that right now? The fucking Argonians. Yeah, that's right. Shit. You know, it's been a long time since I played this. Long, long time. Because I just, uh... I kind of refrain myself from playing this game. Because when I do play it, then I'm just playing it. And then I realize 17 hours have gone by and I'm like, what's my fucking problem? Oh, man. What have I done? What have I done with my life? What am I doing? You know, like, people are like, Oh, like, yeah, like, so you've wasted your life away. Like, no, I haven't. I haven't because I'm only level 55. And the highest level is level, like, 81. So if I did waste my life away at it, I would be the highest level. Which I'm not. And I don't plan on getting to the highest level. Because I just, you know, maybe years and years from now I finally will. But I just, no, man. I can't do that to myself. I can't do it. And, of course, we're climbing the peaks. Because, uh, why the fuck not? Who doesn't do this in Skyrim? Where it's just like, yep, yep, I'm clicking the jump button on the rocks. I'm clicking the jump button on the rocks. I'm so good at Skyrim. Clicking the jump button on the rocks. Okay, so I gotta kind of go down now. We're getting close to the area where I set up my marker to go to. It is, uh, over this way. You know, I had the skeleton key for a while. But, uh, I got rid of it because I got my skill up to 100. And so I was like, well, fuck it. I mean, I'm already at the high skill for that lockpicking, so why have the skeleton key? I might as well just complete the quest, you know? Bandits! Oh! Okay, that was one hit. Yeah, use dragon right on the bandit! What? Oh, so that's it? No, because then it goes away, so it's got to be, like, in the waterfall? No? What the fuck, man? I guess it must be, like, above? Yeah. Yeah, because there's, like, a... Yeah. 
you know, these right here. These right here. Remind me of that Rush album, Test for Echo. Yeah, yeah, like, ever everybody that's like, uh, that statue for the school, what is that? That is a reference to Rush. That's the Test for Echo statue on the front of the cover, which is actually a statue by the, uh, one of the, uh, northern Inuit tribes of Canada. They used to leave those statues around, and, uh, if you were to find that statue, that means that there was life somewhere within, uh, a good distance of the statue, which you could find help if you needed it in the wilderness. It's pretty awesome. Oh, look at this. This little divot. Oh, shit. I almost fell off the cliff. Come on. Come on. Look at this little divot. Let's go check the map. Oh, so I, that's... <laughs> I didn't set up the fucking... Because I guess, like... That doesn't even make any sense, man. I said on the map before to, like, yeah, go and set my marker to this area specifically. So why didn't the marker go away so that way I wasn't walking around in fucking circles for, like, ten minutes? Oh, man. Well, here we are, guys. This is what I was trying to do. Broken Helm Hollow. I don't even know what the fuck is in here. But let's check it out. Man, I've already been at this for, like, 15 minutes and I finally just got to the place. Like, see? Skyrim! Skyrim takes up a lot of time. It kind of feels like a whole grand adventure because it takes up so much damn time. Do, do I want the apple? Do, do I want the apple? Do I want the apple? No. Yeah, my guy is the ultimate sneaker, as you will see. Well, I'm going to go for this. Um, I don't even know what the hell he was doing there. Come on. I don't want the fucking mushrooms. Okay, I guess it won't let me do that. What a bitch. And now it won't let me uncrouch. <laughs> Guys, I don't know what is going on. He won't uncrouch. Come on, man. Something is seriously wrong with this game right now. I can't fucking uncrouch. And I'm like stuck in a corner getting fucking gang raped. Shit! Oh my... Come on, man. Get the fuck out of here. Okay, come on. Uncrouch. Oh my... You see, I'm jumping. And he just crouches again. What an asshole. Oh man, I'm gonna try and walk out of here. And see if it uncrouches me. Right when I'm recording, too, it's just like, hey, fuck you. Oh my god, are you serious? I can't uncrouch. It, I'm seriously clicking the fucking crouch button, guys. This is ridiculous. Because the thing is, he's so much slower. See, look, I try to run. It, it fucking rolls. Come on, man. Fuck it. We're gonna do this whole mission like this. So I can stick it to the game developers. No, I'm just kidding. I love you. Oh, those guys are amazing. Even though sometimes... I mean, come on. No, no game is without its glitches, guys. I mean, you know, even some of like the most classic games, like Mario. There's glitches in that game that you would not even believe. Like, uh, the, the one I just, uh, found out about, like, a few weeks ago was the one where, like, if you meet a ledge right before you're about to fall into a cliff, he'll fucking do, like, a wall jump! I'm like, are you kidding me? Like, in the first Mario game of all of them, there's a fucking wall jump method. So, you know, it's... Oh. Damn it, I didn't want to do that. I'll take it. But yeah, it's just, like, every game has its fucking glitches, and, you know, you just gotta kind of work with them sometimes. Even if they are fucking shit up for you for finding loot. Like so. What the hell? Ha <laughs> ha You thought you had me. It looks like... Yeah. I was like, yeah, it looks like that's a fucking doorway or something. I think I should check up there first, honestly, before I go. Because, uh, you know, in this game... 
Like, if they have something over here, it's like, dude, check over there, because they probably have some, like, fucking potions or something laying around in the back. I can't tell you, this one, this one time, I was playing against this, like, wizard guy, right? And this guy just, I was stuck on him for so fucking long, and I decided, right in the room before I go in to see him, you know what, I'm just gonna explore that room first. And dude, I found this fucking potion! It's one of those potions that you attach to your arrows, and you fire the arrows, and like, what, what it did is basically it stunned him for a period of time to where I could just go up and fuck his shit up. What the hell is my problem? There's... Oh, is he, see, now he's fucking... Oh, well. Oh my god. <gasps> yes! Now we're gonna mine this ore. With the notched pickaxe. Notched pickaxe. Next pickaxe. Next pickaxe. She now nah, she. And then the rock stops glowing because I'm an asshole. This guy's got no. Wait, that's him? Report left Fanny or his death, your family. So that was that guy? I, I don't understand. Man, so many quests I got running in this game. I can't remember all of them. Oh, whatever. Rhodium ore added. We've got a flowing river in the background with that jellyfish looking fucked up uh, mushrooms. Jellyfish mushrooms! That's what I like to call them. But look at those fucking things. You tell me that's not a jellyfish? You're crazy. That's a jellyfish. That's what jellyfish look like when they're mating. Running, I'm running through your head. Whatever the fuck that means, I don't even know. So so far, I've basically covered the basics of Skyrim. I fought a dragon, fucked around in my house for more than ten minutes with my goddamn inventory, jumped up all those fucking rocks, and went through a random ass tunnel and got a quest done that I don't even fucking know about. That's Skyrim, everybody. I don't, I don't really know if I'm gonna end this right here. Actually, you know what? I think I'm gonna go. Just for a little bit longer. Bring it. Bring it, you whores! Rah! You filthy horse! No? Oh, yeah, yeah, good boy. Good boy, now play dead. Yeah. Yeah, you never know what you're gonna find when you're just randomly running through Skyrim. Um. Oh, I was like, dude, do you want to fight? Like, I'm sh what the fuck do you want, bitch? Oh, these are Black Briar guys. I'm taking that, and uh, I'm taking that, cause that's worth the. Oh, woo! okay, all right, that's worth the most. Number five is alive, Stephanie. Your outer appearance has changed. God, if anybody knows what I'm referencing right there, I apologize. I mean, oh. Yeah, I used to like that movie. It's short Circuit. I used to like that movie when I was younger, but man, that movie is fucking weird. The acting in it is a little questionable, but, um... I'm pretty sure that if they did it today, they'd make it a lot cooler. But, uh, just for the campiness sake, they would have to keep the robot looking the same. Because, uh... I think if they updated the robot... Like, too much to where, like, oh, instead of treads, he runs on legs, and, like, no, man, you guys are ruining the whole thing. Like, the whole point of that robot being that big was because it was such a, like, the whole joke of the movie was, like, how can they not find this robot? That's the point. Like, that's what makes that movie, like, on a campiness sense, so fucking hilarious. Like, you got this giant-ass robot. How the fuck are you not gonna find that shit? Well, they don't. Well, they do eventually, but I'm not giving it away for anyone that's never seen it. You guys go and, uh, check it out if you haven't, because it's, it's pretty funny for... Oh, shit. I was like, oh, cool, I hear people talking, maybe they're just, like, captives. He said enough. Does he want to talk? No? Okay. Yeah, you can never tell when somebody in this game's like, Oh, you had to fight me for a second, now I'm cool. Oh, really? Maik! Maik knows everything! Maik! Where the fuck did that bitch go? She, like, ran off. 
She was like, nope, I'm done. I'm done. Oh, sweet. You know what I wish you could do in Skyrim? I wish you could just, like, buy any house you want. Not even lying, because this fucking house looks cool. I want this one. Yeah, are you hiding in the pantry? I feel like a fucking, like, murderer running through trying to find this bitch. Even though that's what I kind of am. I mean, <laughs> I just murdered those people, but, um... No, they're, like, hired to, like, kill me or some shit like that, so... I think my reasons are pretty justifiable. She just, like, disappeared. Oh, well. I must have run off. Oh. Is she in there? I, I don't know, I heard her. I could have sworn that I heard her. No, what am I talking about? I saw the fucking text. Oh well, must have run off. Oh well, must have run off. What the fuck, bitch? I just killed everybody in this house and you're like... Oh well, must have run off. Well, she's gotta be in here then. Bitch! Are you serious right now? Where are you? Oh man, this is the fun of Skyrim, guys. Wait. You pick a bad time. To Fuck get you! Lost. I'm an anteater. Fuck <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Guys, I think she's sleeping. She's just sleeping. That's okay. I'm just gonna um. Yeah, I'm. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna take this. And, um, I, y you were great. You were, you were great. Okay, we got this chest now. And... 12. Well, that wasn't fucking worth it. I wish I had powers where I could just be like, I know it's in that chest just by looking at it. So that way I wouldn't have to waste my fucking time with just walking up and... Like, I, f I feel like, I know that on the PC version, there's probably so many fucking mods about the shit I'm talking about. But, um, hey, that's life. Ooh. Not to say my computer couldn't run it, but I just don't have it. Maybe someday. I cannot sleep while trespassing. Even though I fucking brutally murdered everybody in this house. Well, I have officially brutally murdered everybody in a house. Beat a dragon. Jumped up a shit ton of cliffs. Went through a cave. And completed an objective for a mission that I barely even remember. So, I think we're good. I think, um, I'm gonna call this an end to Skyrim for now, guys. But, you know, I'm gonna be doing, uh, playthroughs and stuff. It's just, uh, what I do. I play games, and I make CNP. And I, uh, am a pretty cool guy who doesn't afraid of anything. Including dragons. And bandits, and wolves. But I fucking hate scorpions! I hate scorpions. Not the Mortal Kombat kind, either. Like, I'm talking real fucking scorpions. I hate those. That's why you should watch me play Fallout 3, because I'm a little girl when it comes to those scorpions. I hate them. If you guys did enjoy this, you should subscribe and check out my other videos. I make CMP, which is an awesome Halo Machinima series. And yes, there is still a Halo Machinima series besides Red vs. Blue. I know that's so shocking to many people, but go check it out and laugh your ass off. You're gonna like it. Trust me. You guys take care. And I'll uh, see you later. Oh shit, a spider! Oh, shit, spider. Okay. He's dead. It's cool, guys. It's cool, guys.